ask them to first return to work. <laughs> Once they return to work, then nobody is going to take any adverse action against the doctors. Let them first come back to work. And then if there's any difficulty, just t- talk to us in the court here. We'll make sure that there is no adverse action against the doctors. We quite see that they were all upset about the fact that there was a very serious incident which took place. And once the doctors, as we hope, resume duty, then we will prevail upon the authorities not to take any uh, adverse, uh, adverse action. Will, yes. How does the public health infrastructure run if the doctors don't resume work? Yeah, on uh, 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 behalf of the AIMS doctor residents, Lord Nagpur, Lord. Lord, on account of their being participating in the agitation and the protest, Lord, now they are being victimized, Lord, on one ground or the other, being marked absent. They are not doing the emergency duties, Lord, but because they were but participating they, in the... Are they, are, they in, are they at work? If they are not at work, they will be marked absent. How can we ask them to do something? Not, not allowing in the exams, Lord, Lord, in one way or the other, Lord. If, in, they, if a lenient they will are, be taken, Lord, if a lenient will be taken. If they are on duty, if they are on duty, they will not be marked absent. If they are not on duty, the law will have to follow its course. How can we tell the administration to take up, uh, to write something which is not correct? Not uh, with respect to the exams and all that, Lord, the, the lenient will be taken, Lord. Because because of this reason, Lord, they were on protesting or, or on strike. That's all right. So yeah. ask them all, ask them to first return to work. Yeah. Once they return to work, then if, uh, nobody is going to take any adverse action against the doctors. That, that will be, come back to work. A word from your Lordship will work, Lord, for them. <laughs> Let them first come back to work. And then if there's any difficulty, just t- talk to us in the court here. We'll make sure that there's no adverse action against the doctors. Very well. We quite see that they were all upset about the fact that there was a very serious incident which took place. But... Let them first report to work, yeah. and then one having reported. They have reported back, Lord. They have reported back. Well, they have reported back. Ames Nagpur reported back, Lord. The resident doctor, they have joined the. This issue, Lord. Lord, you have mentioned on behalf of PGI Chandigarh. Your Lordship, there is, uh, Lordship in PGI Chandigarh, they are going in for a rally for two hours in the morning, but they are doing all their duties. But for nine days, their CL has been deducted now from the leave. So that is a victimization. Yes, you also have to write the research papers you know, and. I, I don't uh, think you know somebody like Dr. Vivek Lal is the director at PGI Chandigarh that you will do anything it, which is the, Lord, which amounts to victimization. Lordship, I am only saying that all the individuals, ultimately, inputs. the directors of these institutions. Yes, he made a statement. They also have their heart with the doctors, but yes, they are in a situation where poor people who come to those institutions cannot be left behind in the lurch. Yes, sir. That they take appointments two years before the actual date. And then suddenly you are told that you will not be attended to. Let them all resume work. And I'm sure the directors are all very seasoned directors who have spent their life in these institutions. They are not going to do anything against but the doctor. I think Lord, 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 right now the notice is, the notice that they have been given is that since or for nine days you've been on the rally. So we are deducting your nine days of casual leave. We'll, 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 uh, we'll pass some general order. Yes, yes. yes we'll pass some general yes. order on that. I, I, Lordship, may I make Lord, one? May I, may one? I say please some? Rest assured, please rest assured that once the doctors, as we hope, resume duty, then we will prevail upon the authorities not to take any uh, adverse, uh, adverse action. Will, yes. But they must first come back to duty for the simple reason, otherwise the people who, they are people few, who, people they are who need, them are people who need the services the most are deprived of their yes, services. That's the only concern. How does the public health infrastructure run if the doctors don't resume work? Lord, uh, only, first, only my Lord, right, now first let's have the uh, status report. We first want to see Lord, the These are the three report. copies. Lord, I believe the anguish of the doctor is correct, but having uh, come from your lordships, an assurance that your lordships are looking into it, Malod. I think that should satisfy Malaja. With the assurance of no adverse action, Malod. Lord, we are absolutely not grateful to your lordships that lordships have intervened. Lord, we have not been heard, Malod, at all. Our grievances, Malod, are at the forefront because we are, Malod, facing the brunt, brunt of this, Malod, uh, whatever well, is happening. The reason why we constituted such a broad-based committee is that we have specifically said that the committee shall engage with all stakeholders, okay. including that will include the resident doctors. So please assure them. Yes. Please assure them yes. that the committee. That the, one second, Mr. Ansari. Sorry, sorry. Please assure the uh, resident doctors. They all are young doctors. That they will be heard by the. Uh, we heard, Malod, and some representation. But tell us one thing. We can hear you, Mr. Uh, uh, Mr. Kamath. We hear you for half an hour. We are not going to, we are not the committee. Ultimately, you have to be heard by the committee. Yes, what we were requesting, Malod, 
some milords uh, association whatever your lordship yes. suppose not some representative from the resident doctors association if they can be a yes. part of the committee yes. so there is one second response i'm sorry i'm not saying uh, you see the, please understand but we leave it to your lordships now sir come on please voice, understand we have, we have thought through this very carefully if we start now asking for the representatives of various stakeholders possible we are part of the committee that becomes an impossible process because you know the committee's work will then get dislocated you know what happens you are such an experience yourself at the same time we are conscious of the fact that the primary concerns of the doctors the no. nurses the paramedical staff there's a pen drive has to be taken into account by the members of the committee yes. you know for two things that on the committee we have very 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 senior women doctors in the committee yes. the doctors who are on the committee are people who have worked for a long time in their life as part of public health infrastructure so therefore what we have expected the committee to do is that the committee will hear these various stakeholders namely the uh, the the interns the uh, residents the senior residents uh, representatives of the nurses the other paramedical staff Uh, so therefore, you know, they are in a hospital. There are a huge number of stakeholders. The committee will ensure that it will hear representative. Uh, I put on, not in fact, I have taken instructions. So I represent about thirty thousand doctors. Please and and you know, Mr. Samad, please tell them. Yes. Please tell them that the committee will definitely give them a hearing. We'll reiterate that in our order today. You will not reiterate that. You will certainly, Mr. Samad. Your point is well taken. We'll make it. We'll make it clear. My Lord, not fit for parental. I am a Lord. Not will get symptoms. Yeah. Absolutely, Mr. Kamath. Uh, we are we are grateful to you actually for uh, personally because you know we our hearts go out to all those people who have to go to public hospitals. So we will make an observation that the committee would hear all stakeholders, including the resident doctors association. Of course, not thirty thousand doctors, but a representative. One pardon application. Right. Yeah. And they, and and an appointment can be given to them when the committee assembles, so that the committee can because your stake. Yes. is very high and your inputs are very valuable so please assure the resident doctors we that we were now passing an order that the committee will give them a representative voice in uh, putting forth their grievances their working conditions yeah. so on and so forth suggestions today and our suggestion we can then call off their milords protest we will also say that